Hi Saj, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for March 31st until April 6th. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Okay. Uh, okay, Sag. It looks like there is a fire sign that you have been keeping, or that you're, you know, keeping uh, in communications with. And it seems like by the time that you travel, or by the time that you, well, you will be traveling on the around Tuesday, or within the next two days, two weeks, or two months. And it seems like. You've been thinking a lot about this person and you're pretty much excited that they are coming. But unfortunately, this person is going to be a little bit indecisive. I don't really feel like they're going to be uh, coming or I don't feel like that they will honor their word or their promise. And your entire family or you itself is already waiting for this because you feel like that there will be a brand new beginning. And all of you are pretty much excited about, you know, what's about to unfold. But unfortunately that this person is just being indecisive and playing around with, with all of you, including you. Now, you will have a hard time because you have expected so much that this person is actually the right one for you. And that you have kept so much from somebody that you're still currently with or that, you know, or that uh, trying to free yourself from. But unfortunately, it's like there will be a balance of things that it's not, <coughs> this is not yet the right time <coughs> for the two of you to really get reunited. Especially that there is another person that will be suffering if you do this. Now, you need to free yourself up from like the current bindings that you have with somebody before getting engaged into someone. And I feel like this person that you're thinking about or that you're waiting for, they are still entangled with somebody and they are, you know, whatever they have said to you in the past, they don't really mean it. And uh, it looks like for this person, your chapter is already over or your story is already over. So if you are currently thinking that there that there could still be a brand new beginning for the two of you, you're wrong. Because there will be a defeat a betrayal someone will will also be acting you know a little bit um, devious and the thing here is if you want to make a brand new beginning you have to learn how to gamble instead of playing safe that while you are still with someone you will try to be with another person and then when that person becomes successful then that's the only time that you will let go of the other which is you know Right now, life is trying to teach you to be a little bit more fair, okay? If you want to be with another person, then gamble and leave the other. And you're also waiting for money, okay, to come from your work. Or you're waiting for work to come because you needed money. This, well, and then you will start thinking about this older air sign from the past, which is as much as you don't want to ask for help from this person, it looks like you don't have any other choice, but then this person will also be turning you down. And another one is that especially if you're with a fire sign or an, or an air sign right now, I don't feel like you're going to be getting a support from your spouse or from your partner because they know pretty much what's going on and what you're trying to do so they will be cutting you off and, and, and also their support and don't expect that they will be tolerating all of these things that's been happening because i feel like there will be two things or two chapters in your life that will be ending soon 
And you just need to be ready because, um, well, the storm is about to come, even though it's still at a distance. And... I feel like you will try one last time with a water sign to communicate with. Until that you will just think of either moving into a new house, opting for a new house, buying a new house, or selling your property at this point. But I don't really feel like you will be getting the, uh, you know, the amount that you need because I feel like... Uh, so you need to rethink more of your plans because I don't feel like this is really the right time for you to be indecisive and if the times before has been in favor of you right now you need to be a little bit more careful because there is a lesson to learn and you know this person that you keep on going back and forth with especially if this is another fire sign you know that this person did not really do anything to you. It did not do any good to you in the past. And then you just keep on coming back and forth, back and forth, and hoping that this person will still, re you know, remember and uh, consider, okay, your past. But this person have already moved on. And I feel like they're, you know, pretty much happy with wherever they are. It's just that they're trying to get back at you for whatever you have done to them in the past. But you are under that false pretense that this person will always be in love with you or will st or are still in love with you. It could be because of what they are saying, but they are just playing around with you. And right after you talk or right after turning your back there, they do mock you. So you have to open up your eyes and you have to be a little bit more conscious of this person because, you know, it's just a total waste of time. And you've already missed out five good opportunities in the past because of this because you, you want to take a shortcut but then right now all of that will be come to waste will be coming to waste and there are three people that will be that you will also be losing or that you that will be turning their backs on you because they're already tired of helping you or they don't want to you know they don't want to get involved you know with any ordeals or with any stuff that you're going to be getting yourself into and now instead of you proceeding up ahead it's like you're you keep on going back and forth back and forth and then going around back and forth okay so it's time for you to straighten up your path and it's time for you to come clean and it's time for you to proceed ahead to your journey no shortcuts and do not use anybody as a ladder okay Anyway, that's it for you for this week, Sagittarius. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live on the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.